days after the massive downtown Raleigh fire, we continue to see pieces of the damage. CBS North Carolina's Justin Quisenberry joins us now live with how it's affecting a local church. Justin? Well, Sean, you see behind me the rubble from that massive apartment fire, that apartment that was under construction. And take a look at just how close it came to this building that I'm standing beside. This is the youth center for Edenton Street United Methodist Church. Now, we want to show you some photos that a church staff member took of the roof damage. You can see charred places all over the place. Even the skylights melted. The church will have to replace the roof. Water caused most of the damage, especially to the second floor. Soaked ceiling tiles fell to the floor. The church will also need to replace some of the walls in the gym behind cushion pads. The good news, the worship area suffered the least amount of damage and the church youth will likely be able to return there this Sunday. Ahead at six, hear from a crew about what goes into cleaning all this up and just exactly how long that process will take. Live in Raleigh, Justin Quisenberry, CBS North Carolina.